I know he's not looking too great, but I basically moved three cherry barbs, four neon tetras and four black neon tetras from this tank. And I put the filter and the heater into a bigger tank and added some Harlequin Rasboras. And that was a month ago. And as I was netting out the Neon Tetras, I realized this little guy basically had Neon Tetra disease. He looks like a zombie, look. He doesn't look well at all. So instead of euthanizing him, he's still eating. I thought, I'll leave him in here. He'll probably die in a few days. Give him his last couple of meals rather than just kill him. And a month is winter as well in the UK. It's been getting to minus three at night some nights. And this is in my kitchen, so it, it gets pretty cold in here. I'm also in an old building without double glazing, so it really does get cold in here. No heater, no filter. I've probably only done about two water changes in the space of the month that he's just been sat here. And he's, he's fine. He's absolutely indestructible. It's a shame because obviously I can't put him with all, any, well, I can't put him with any of my other fish because look at him. It's, from what I've researched, it's pretty obvious that it's that neon tetra disease that makes them just look mental. And obviously, if he dies or if somebody eats a, a bit of him, they catch it and, and so on. And it's supposed to be an absolutely mental disease. But this little guy's lived in here now for a month. I just thought to myself, how long's it been? Because I could put the filter back into this tank now that the other one has gone through a full cycle. So basically, I put a new filter in the other tank and I put the old filter in so I could move the fish and it would be instantly cycled. So now I'm thinking I can move the old filter back into here and the new tank will be cycled on the new filter. Well, this guy doesn't need a filter or a heater. Like, he ate a bloodworm last night, gave him a cheeky little bloodworm as a little treat. I mean, I guess I'll just keep him in here on his own and... Watch, I'll still have him in like two years time. <laughs> He's literally immortal. A Highlander Neon Tetra. <laughs>